Hello everybody, welcome back, anyone who's watching, to part two of PAL Worlds. Last time we uh, started off the game, I built a, a pretty cool house, fought a bunch of PALs, got killed a couple times, and the other guys are sleepy boys looking down there. It's uh, just about turning night time, and you know what? Uh, let's get into it. Let's get some PALing around. Um, let's see. Man, these guys just... They, they just don't care. They said, right now, time to sleep. I already have one, so, you know, I kind of don't really need to catch either of them. You know, and I don't really know if I need anything they drop. Are these guys... Are these guys alpacas? Oh, that's wonderful. I must have one. I must have one. They don't seem very powerful. Oh! They have a charge attack, I respect that. Did I dodge that? Oh, I think I did. Oh, no, wait, no, that was my shield. Guy. Is he asleep? Did he drown? What happened to him? Now he's just sleeping in the water. What? That's weird. Um. Now I wonder if this wooden barrel shelf has um, more storage space than the little boxes. I assume it does because it has so much more uh, space requirements. So I'm gonna go chop down a little bit of. Uh, Wood, and then see how much storage that has. And there they go. I can see over there the um, significant thugs are attacking the memorist again. And based on what I saw last uh, episode, that did not go very well for them. Because that memorist is an absolute beast. I'm still over and Wow. Uh, let me see. I only need 10, so. Am I good? I am good. My penguin's probably freaking out, like, why did you just bring all this back out here? I just put it all away. Uh, <laughs> I'm sorry, little guy. Um, where can I put this? Because it doesn't seem to really want me to be able to put it down inside, which is weird. What if I'm upstairs? Can I put it down? Weird. Um, I guess I'll put it down in the front. Uh, I can probably put it down outside. Do I need to put it on the floor? Too close to a special boss facility, so I just can't build this area. Okay, so I think I just can't build it right there, so I guess I'll have it set like that? Okay, yeah, that seems pretty alright. Was it a tree? It's kind of sad when they just kind of lay there. Let me just, let me just give her that. There we go. Out of sight, out of mind. <laughs> Let's check the storage on this. Um, it's not much better. I gotta say, not much better. I'm a little disappointed about that actually. So I just need wood, really. And I should probably make uh, the lumber yards and things. <laughs> Look at this guy. Ooh, a mammarist. What, what are the odds that I could um, take down a mammarist? Let me. I, I, I gotta try it. I gotta try it. Um, I know it's probably not 
a good idea, but imagine if we did take him down. That'd be such a strong pal to get. No. Oh. Uh, let's see. Okay, yes, it's still there. Um, that should maybe hit it. Oh, there's very little drop on the bushes. One damage. Ooh. That is not great. Um, I am not fighting that by my face. I have changed my mind about that. Though on the other, oh yeah, there's some of those uh, syndicate grunts over here. Oh no! Oh, I didn't even notice. I'm actually starving. Oh, are they attacking my pals? Oh no! Oh my, just wasted it. Oh, Tom Bat's actually down. I didn't even notice. Oh, I wasn't paying attention. Alright, maybe I can stall it with a ball. Oh, it doesn't even work. I don't ain't sure we really put a dent into its hell. Oof. Well, at the very least, I can lead it away from my face. Oh! I didn't realize I was out of stamina. I'm gonna to die in the silliest way. After all of that, I'm gonna die in such a silly yeah. way. And I wasted a pal. A pal. Ah. A pal spear. Ah. <laughs> Back to us. There we go. Uh, I feel like I should assess the damage back at base and uh, put all my uh, injured pals back in the pal box so they can uh, regenerate. Uh, pal box pressure. Recover all of you guys. I am sorry for putting you guys in so much danger. That was one. Uh, right over here, I guess. Can I put it there? I can. Alright, um, I'm going to wait until my pals are back because I don't want to sit there for a whole 44 seconds. It's not a long time, but it's a lot of time to really doing a lot. So far, I'm thinking Power World. It's a pretty fun game, and I've seen a lot of it. I imagine that types, each pal does, uh, does have their own type. Yeah, they were mining a lot of this. Well, each pal does have their own type, so that makes me uh, wonder if um, there are things like type advantage and stuff in like their Pokemon. And if there is, then. How exactly do they work? Okay, yeah, 40 seconds. Because that'd be something really uh, interesting to look at. Everyone's a fight. Alright, this looks ridiculous. This looks ridiculous. What is this? <laughs> Why is this a feature? This is a weird feature. Um. That's very interesting. Uh, no work available in the immediate vicinity switching to automatic work mode. Um, they farm. Or, I believe they do farm in related things. 
I don't think they'll be able to work on my uh, my buildings because you know they don't really have hands. Like uh, Depresso, Lift Monk, and uh, Pingle, kind of, and Kentavia as well. They have hands, uh, so you know they're able to work on things like that. But him, uh, Melpaca, uh, not really able. Let's see, can I make any more arrows? I can, because I spent all of the arrows I just made uh, trying to take down the. I don't even remember what it's called. The grass mammoth. I might go and trade to uh, get a tan. They're uh, pretty low level. Ooh. I did some great, uh, pretty big work on my shield. Uh, that pretty bad right there. That, okay, I was gonna say, I thought it was a whole bunch of uh, transies. It's just a bunch of syndicate, uh, syndicates. Caught uh, 10 uh, pals. That's pretty nice. This is my third, or my 10th pal. Uh, Tansy. Very nice, very nice. I wonder if I can assign him to work here. Let's see. Do I have a pal upgrade? Uh, berry plantation, deployed pal. I can have four pals, so let me see if I can assign him. What does he do? Uh,. <laughs> Handling, lumbering, transporting, gathering, planting. Uh, yeah, he's pretty efficient. He's uh, sleepy. I guess I did just beat him up a little bit, so you know, he does a little bit of rest. Oh, it looks like he's outside, uh, actually working on something. I think he's working on the, uh, on the, uh, lumber yard. So I look at my window, yep, he's working on it. Very nice, very nice. Passively produce wood? I think it will. Let me just see what happens when he uh, finishes up this bar. Is he getting? Is there gonna be wood added to it? Oh, it passively farms wood. So that one over there, when it's created, uh, will passively farm stone. Very interesting. Ooh, is that an egg? It is a verdant egg. Very interesting. I don't have the materials to make a uh, egg incubator, but I do wonder if we can get some pretty cool uh, or even rare pals from uh, the eggs that we hatch. Lost sleeping lamb doll. Is that? Oh, is that a? It's a nightwing. I have yeah. been wondering about the nightwing. I kind of want one, and I want to know if I can fly around. Yeah. Oh, he threw up immediately. Oh, he brought him down. Alright. Ooh, not a very high chance to catch. Oh, and I missed. There's like one more. Alright, this we're just gonna have to hope that this uh this works. If not, we're just gonna have to take him down. We got him. Nice. Okay, um. Can I fly around? Can be written as a flying mount. Um, oh, it's locked. I wonder how we can uh, unlock it. Let me increase this. And oh, I have a point. Kind of made it look like I had more than one. Um, maybe you need a saddle. Ooh, berry plantation. That's part of my uh, quest. Let's see what else we got. Oh, Melpaca saddle safety. Uh, saddle for safety riding Melpaca. Very interesting. The tundra outfit and the tropical outfit. Those could be worth getting a hot spring. Um, uh, this sandbags pals assigned to it will watch for approaching enemies. Uh, I'm not sure if I need that way at the moment. Catches pals that pass through, only effective on small pals and humans. I'll learn that and the alarm. <laughs> Uh, something lively moves within placing an egg incubator will incubate. Okay. My, uh, <laughs> Let's see. Oh, he's got the cowards. Unfortunately. Requires nightwing saddle, craft blood, paddle, 
our pal gear workbench okay so that makes me think that if i scroll i might be able to find a nightwing saddle let's see yes right here at level 15 we'll be able to craft that with things that don't seem too hard to get though i don't have any ingots so i'm not sure how that will be oh pal sphere nice i actually uh used my last one trying to catch this nightwing Sorry, Lamb. Kinda need the. Now, is this guy supposed to be out of the water? I feel like he's not. Looks like a, a Manaphy. Or not Manaphy. That is a completely different Pokemon. Um, I forget the name. But anyway, let's just go ahead and try to catch one actually, because this one's just in the water. <laughs> Oh, never mind. He is very much gone. We're in like a beach area. Ooh, there's another fast travel station over there too. I can set that up and be able to get around the map uh, even easier. Let's see. Let's oh, we have found the marshlands. Very interesting. Oh, wait a minute. That is not the fast travel station. <sighs> the fast travel station's over there. Sealed Realm of the Invincible. Nah, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, level 23 dungeon? Sounds a bit out of reach for now. <sighs> so, I think I might just stick to, uh... The surface for now. That's something else. An interesting thing is here is that that dungeon was level 23, but all the pals out here are rather low level. Makes me wonder uh, how scaling works in this game. Is there scaling? Uh, is the game generous enough to make it so uh, most of the pals out in the wild? are the same level as you? Or is this just a low level area? <gasps> yeah, syndicate area. How many arrows do I have? 21. This guy's a low level. Did 81 damage with that. They do have firearms though, which could be a problem. There might be a It took a couple of arrows to take that guy out. If I just keep doing this, I should have taken him out relatively easily. I didn't anger the uh, memorist and hope that was the syndicates actually. Alright, let me run around. It doesn't look like they're angry at me. Oh, they might. Oh. There's some interesting looking pals here. There's a duck. There's whatever's in that cage. It looks like it could be special. Yeah, those uh, memorists are angry. I need to kind of get them eye on aggro. Or I might be able to just lose him. Oh, no, he lost aggro actually. Nice. Um, I do think I saw a chest over here on this side. Or something. I did see a chest. Alright. Well, ooh. And one of those trees. That, uh, what's it called? Ooh, a bunch of arrows, some money. Ooh, Mega Sphere, nice. And those trees that are basically like TMs. If 
but probably for water uh, panels. Electric dragon and water panels. So I guess just kind of all the tree, all the berries can uh, grow on uh, these trees. Interesting. Now let's see. Uh, release pal. Are you a special pal? Ribbony, a pal who never without a big smile occasionally gets the tentacles tied up in knots. Cavity is uh, pranks during those moments. The expression changes something. First captured XP bonus. So did I just get that pal? Um. It doesn't look like it's my party. Uh, I'm not sure what the max pals you can have is. It might be five, but Pokemon it's six. So I'm real not quite sure. Oh wow, Dire House. That could be interesting to catch. <laughs> Back to home. Look at these little guys. He's like, but you'll run away. <laughs> and then I show up and he sees me and he just runs too. I should actually make a spear. Yeah, I'll make one of those. Now, can you come over here to help me real quick? I should help the little guy. Oh. Where did he go? Oh, no. Start uh, moving resources around. We've got some little hard workers over here, each with their own perfectly sized tiny hammer. And we have a ranch. Very nice. Required farming. I'm not sure if any of my pals currently have farming. I need to, uh. Oh, yeah, I can upgrade my pal box and then put my, uh. My alpaca, yeah. Uh, upgrade the statue of power. Oh, you make them. I see. There. I'm not sure what you're really gonna do for me over here. But something. Oh, yes, I need a new bed. For my pals. Nice. Oh. Everybody's, uh, hard at work. What's wrong, Cantavia? Oh yeah, I should make the, the sauna or the, uh, the hot spring. Pal fluid. Interesting. Nice to see that I think it pulls resources from containers. Catch the higher level. Nice try, Fuddler. Nice try. 
try again. Let me try my bow. That's what I'm They gave us some money for defeating those. Interesting. <laughs> it's a lamb ball. The boss of this dungeon is a big lamb ball. Oh, yeah, that's kind of funny. Especially because they have. Oh! Never mind. I was going to say they only had melee attacks, I thought. I've never seen them uh, use anything else. Yeah, they usually use this attack. And you got dizzy. I feel like you couldn't have gotten to use your uh, pals boss for this. Next to our base, very nice. Also, for anybody, if anyone really watched the first episode, <clears throat> I made this episode very soon on the same day actually as the first episode. So, if you did watch and uh, have come into the name for pals, then I have not yet read those comments. <clears throat> and we'll be getting around to that um, tomorrow once this uh, once the videos are uploaded and I'm able to read those. Ancient civilization parts to breeze excavate from ancient ruins can find information lost in technology in this room valuable. People from all works of life in this in such crystals. Interesting. Interesting indeed. So like uh, that. 
and then uh, work on this. My pals can come over here and make it uh, go by a lot faster. Yeah, now it's done. Ten seconds, pretty much. I have an unused scan stat point. Oh yeah, for my uh, my actual stats. Oh, there you go. You guys can uh, relax in that. Um, capture power. Offers only give cheese statue capture power. Interesting, is that it? Uh, view enhanced pals. Enhanced pals? Oh, soul. Okay, so use souls to enhance your pals. And use the effigies to enhance my capture power. Interesting. And now I need four to increase it. Interesting. <coughs> the hell blow guys. Seems like Tansy gets stuck pathfinding it quite a bit. There we go. There's a Mamorot angry at something over there. Is he fighting a Mamorot? That's very interesting. I might be able to catch one. That's definitely a Mamorot fighting another Mamorot. Um, what's the button? Uh, two. A Megasphere. Yeah, I can catch one. I think I can, because if they're fighting each other, then I should be able to just throw a ball at whichever one, uh, when one of them gets weak. Ooh. Oh. Let me see if I can get over there. chance. He's dead. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, did my ball not work? Uh. Oh, he knocked out Tom bad I even notice. It's a good thing the shield takes them the whole attack. Out if I can't catch it. Nightwing is flying, so he should be immune to earthquakes. Not prepared for that. Well, can you blame me for trying? Ah, uh, you got stuck by the vixen. Uh, you have to fight pretty much. Yeah. All right, did we get him? Yeah, we caught him. That's a new pal. It's an electric pal. We don't have any of those yet. So unless something interesting happens, I'm gonna uh, cut back to base, and I will end off the video of episode two of Pal World. This Mamorous, yeah, he's lucky. He's very lucky. Oh, actually. Alright, that's it. <laughs> I'm out of here. <laughs> I tried. Alright guys, that will end off episode 2 of Pal World. We got a couple new pals, uh, took on our first dungeon. We found uh, a nice uh, lamb ball boss. He was kind of a pushover, but uh, still, first dungeon boss taken care of. That was, uh, that's fun. Um... Excited to do more in PAL Worlds. Uh, we almost took down that Mammoth and even almost kind of caught one for a moment, but uh, those odds for catching him is just minuscule. 
So uh, maybe next time or uh, a little bit later down the road. But uh, thanks for watching, everybody. And uh, uh, if you want your uh, to name any of the pals, uh, just uh, comment down a name and uh, for what pal. And yeah, like, you could name them. Uh, peace out, guys. Thank you.